Uh, the more data we have and, and can publish showing that having higher levels of omega-3 uh, in your blood, which means higher levels in your tissue, which comes from eating more EPA and DHA. When we can publish studies showing that higher levels are associated with lower risk for heart, heart attacks, lower risk for uh, death from all causes, lower risk for death from heart disease, from cancer, uh, lower risk for dementia, uh, lower risk for heart failure, uh, lower risk for atrial fibrillation, other heart issues. Uh, that evidence becomes compelling. And, and given the safety of omega-3 fatty acids, there's no risk involved with asking patients to, or, or just consumers, anybody, to increase their EPA DHA intake. You know, again, whether it's from supplements or having them start eating salmon or sardines a little more often. Uh, you, you'll get a bump in your omega-3.